Hello everyone and welcome back to Chemical React. It's -a me, Fusion Form, and over there, like always, is my co-host Gorilla Fist. How's it going? And today we're doing something a little different because we're doing the we're talking about episode four of Tokyo Revengers, but we're also reacting to Tokyo Five. Yep. And that has to do with uh, missing audio for four from one of us, but. If you want to see me babbling to myself and uh, Gorilla mouthing words, you can see it on the Patreon. But episode four, uh, not much in action, but a lot of plot development and a big reveal. Uh, one, one such reveal was that his best friend pushed him onto the train tracks. And then, um, because, I don't want to say because an algorithm of YouTube doesn't like it, but uh, he went skydiving afterwards at the end. Yep, and Kisaki. How do you say his name? Kisaka? I don't know. I put you there. Anyway, that bad guy. He was there the whole time listening. But anyway, we ultimately think he's going to be, you know, going back in time, and now he has to save his friends. He got to save everybody. He likes everybody. He got to save everybody. Yeah, his friend bet his life on it. He, <laughs> he's <laughs> like, now you have to go back and save him. Like, oh my God. Why? I don't like these circumstances. But, uh, but episode four was a really good, sh really good episode. A little slow, but a lot of big reveals, and that was really good. Yeah. yeah. So, on to episode five. Um, now that uh, pretty much the bad guy knows, everyone knows. I don't. I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure. I, in, at some point, Takamichi's gonna tell his girlfriend, right? God, I hope so. I mean, everybody else knows. Why can't she know at this point, right? <laughs> yep. And so, I don't know what's going to happen. Because I threw out this random theory that has no no weight to it. But, like, the bad guy could be time traveling, too. <laughs> could you imagine that? I love that. No, don't bring this into like this. Oh, man. But yeah. I don't really know what's going to happen here. I'm excited. Usually excited. So, before we start, if you enjoyed reacting to this episode, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Also, come join our Discord, Twitter, and Patreon if you want to support us or stay up to date or get access to our uncut raw reaction to this series and many more. And without further ado, Fusion, I got my fingers up. And three, two, one, go. Oh, it's her. You're fired! <laughs> Yeah. Oh, hey, look. Hey. Over... Oh. <laughs> what do you mean the easy way out? Who cares? Your sister's life is on the line. That wouldn't happen. Don't listen to him. Uh. Oh. You now have a reason to go back in time, right? Mikey and Draken. But you don't see them fighting each other? Well, they're like best friends. Yeah, but like, uh, Draken has a tendency to go a little overboard where Mikey has some sense, you know? He was about to go smack, you know, Hina, and Mikey was like, I would never hit a woman. I think I think he was just around like him, though. I don't know. I just think Draken's a savage compared to Mikey, but then Mikey just knows how to kick butt. Hey, wait, talk again? about your money situation, though. You're a little poor now. You don't have a job. <laughs> no way, the brother can cover it. Well, they haven't talked about it, though. <laughs> what? Uh... What is happening? <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> what does he do on his when he's not there? He got cooler. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Mama. <laughs> Later. <laughs> I wonder how he got to this point. Uh oh. Oh no. <laughs> Oh no, is she, she, she sniffing him? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh. oh no, then you don't do Oh. Mm. I, I, yeah. He it's, must go. His body must revert to the past. There you go. That God, sucks. That sucks. So. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> well, yo. But then again, like, now that I, we know this. I would. Like, yeah. I don't want him to ever go back to the press. <laughs> yeah. I was kind of with her. Oh, look at you acting. So respectable. <laughs> Emma. Uh. Oh. Oh, oh shit. Uh oh. <laughs> yeah, of course. Uh oh. <laughs> this is not good. Oh no. No. Don't say that. Oh no. Oh, she's like... This is intense. What is this, like some blood oath going on? It's kind of what it seems like. Uh, all the, it's like all the commanders are here. Oh, the other guys. Mm, looks like they need to, need to get their ass whooped. They only respond to authority. <laughs> Not really authority, but an ass whooping. You know he's gonna have to step in and just make everyone respect him, right? Yeah, that's what I'm waiting for. This is what's gonna happen. Oh. Oh. Oh, I can see why he's angry. Yeah. Okay, that got real dark. <laughs> oh, we gonna fight. And this is the fight that gets him killed. Yeah, yeah, yeah of course we gonna fight. Command respect. Wait, the third? Didn't he die on the fifth? Hmm. Wait, what was the point of oh no, I guess it was the third. Uh. 
this kid's fear. <laughs> what? The little things in life that makes him happy, right? <laughs> I love it. Hospital. Oh, get ready for the fields, everybody. The girlfriend? Oh. Yeah. Oh my god. The gang needs to be stopped, Gorilla. <laughs> I told you this. I was ready to fight. Eh. I completely understand Mikey and I completely understand the father. All right. I also understand Dragon. Ah. I don't know how I feel this... about this. <laughs> oh man. I'm angry, but I'm all like, damn, I, I gotta take it. <laughs> this is really sad. <laughs> you tell a V. Damn. <laughs> well, Draken has the most sense. Who do, who's dead in the future? I actually have no clue. <laughs> I, I'm so confused with who's dead in the future between these two. Yeah. Draken with the moral compass and Mikey. Okay, and so Draken held him in check. Probably oh, sacrificed yeah. himself uh, for Mikey, huh? Yeah. Oh man. Left him with the sad feels, damn it. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> so dark. <laughs> oh man. I just want more. I know. I just feel sad. <laughs> but they have I uh, you know, good job. You did a good job. <laughs> you did a good job. Good job. Well, I mean, how often do you feel uh, bad about anything? Here, they actually really went through all the effort, and it did a good. I think they did a good job. I felt bad, and you know me, I was trying not to look sad. Just, that's just who I am. <laughs> but yeah, I knew right from the get go. So when, when they explained all that stuff, I was like, "Oh, they have to be beaten up." <laughs> it's pretty dark situation that has triggered the start of this war. Mm -hmm. I like to think. I like to think of it like uh, it's a it's a constant reminder that there are like rules and boundaries in this show. You know, it's an anime, but you know. Okay, but let's talk about the real issue here. He has no control of his body once he goes back to the present. That's a big problem because even if he resolves everything, he he has like new friends. He has his old friends. That he he's not gonna. Is he gonna? When did he move? That's like the big question, because he says he moves at some point to get away. Yeah, after high school graduation. And well, no, he he moved to get away from the the group that was 
Yeah, but after graduation, he left because of those reasons, because of that group, the bully, the gangs, and everything. No, he left before going to high school. Okay, well, I don't know. And so that's clearly not going to happen because he's that whole situation's been fine because he was in that compromising situation at the start of the episode, or, or start of the flashback to the past. You can call that a flashback. Um, and now his his person is doing something different from what his past used to be. Yeah. Which he has no recollection of in the future because it's in, he didn't do it, even though he did it. It's weird. <laughs> yep. But I feel like in more due time, more, he'll more, I don't know, we'll get more information. I don't know. Who knows? Maybe he might go back to the future, but he might record himself. <laughs> or something. Yeah, he but... needs to somehow, like, contact himself when he leaves. Like, leave a message. Oh, okay. Okay, like... he's gonna make a video recording, or he's gonna make a notebook, or a journal, or something. Write something on the walls and be like, write everything down, you bastard. <laughs> he needs to, and that, that get his past self on the put, same like, put go on wavelength. as well put like top five don't cheat on your girl be loyal <laughs> like these motives on the wall you know hang what I mean? out with her <laughs> listen be with dragon you know all the important little pieces of information be with the gang be down with the gang next episode big epic fight dragon might have to sacrifice himself i'm assuming from uh, for mikey and uh our main protagonist the, our, our homeboy's gonna stop it <laughs> Yep, and he's gonna come into the clutch, and everyone's gonna look at him, and they're gonna make him a lieutenant. And then, pa, you hate him, bastard. And, 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 and I don't you know, I take that by you, and I friends. hate him. You have every right to hate, damn it. I, I hate those. I take my frustration on Mobius. <laughs> I'm angry. I'm sad. I'm everything. <laughs> uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Let me know. <laughs>